Today is the deadline for all state employees in Massachusetts to prove they're fully vaccinated. But the Union for State Troopers says the Baker administration is dragging its feet when it comes to troopers who want exemptions. WBZ's Louisa Moeller is live in Boston with the very latest. Louisa? Paula, standing right here just a couple minutes ago, the state police union said roughly 300 members remain unvaccinated. And of that number, 200 have sought exemptions from the state and haven't heard back from the state about whether they'll receive those exemptions. The union says that lack of communication is causing anxiety and the mandate could also draw down on an already understaffed force. Now, according to the Baker administration, of the roughly 42,000 state employees who needed to provide proof of vaccination or submit an exemption waiver by yesterday's deadline, there are about 1,600 who they don't have responses from. Today, that means managers and state departments will seek out those employees to ask their status. And after that, they could face what the Baker administration is calling progressive discipline and ultimately termination. Both the state police union and the union representing corrections officers tried to fight the vaccine mandate in court without success. Last week, the corrections union said that roughly 1,500 members of about half of their force had not complied. Governor Baker activated 250 National Guardsmen to fill those shortages. Baker has continually argued that vaccination is the best tool for keeping employees and their families safe, but the state police union says it's a strain on their workforce, which was already short-staffed, about 600 uniformed troopers in total. Let me be clear. Our concern is not one of anti-vaccination. In fact, the vast majority, almost 85% of our membership is vaccinated. Our concern is based on the lack of fundamental fairness in the administration's consistent efforts to undermine the processes by which organized labor secures the rights of its members. On August 19th, Governor Baker announced that there would be a 60 days to bargain and implement a policy for mandated vaccinations. Well, 60 days has passed. Though, we're, though we are beyond the deadline, we have not received even one reply to the several hundred medical and or religious exemption requests that were submitted. Now, unless they were told otherwise, state employees were asked to attend work as usual as the state is still reviewing these exemptions. The Baker administration released a statement today saying that they're working with a small number of state employees to uh, go over exemptions and uh, potentially put into place progressive discipline later on. Live outside the State House, Louisa Moeller, WBZ News.